Hello everybody. Um, today I'm going to teach you how to make algorithms in a program called Cube Explorer. Um, this is version point. Um, this is excuse me, version four point thirty. Blah, can't talk. Um, both of these algorithms I'm going to be teaching you are middle layer algorithms. So uh, let's get started. Before you get started, you need to make sure that this auto fix colors is turned off. Okay, that could get kind of annoying. Now let's go ahead and gray all these out, all these top layers, things out. I'm going to show you how to create like a little form and in this little area here, and then you can print out the algorithms on a little sheet. And then I might la and later on in another video teach you how to so teach you how to memorize these algorithms really easily. Uh, I can memorize these. I can memorize a new algorithm about a day now. Um, now I'm going to go ahead and set up a case where this is flipped as you can see I've already done that and then I'm going to go ahead and click add and solve and um, let's go ahead and stop search here because my algorithm that I use is already in here then hit add solutions to main window now I use a second one I don't use the first one this one I actually use a second one what we're going to do is we're going to right click it and hit add copy generator to clipboard okay and when we click that it'll copy it and then what we do is we just clear out this main window and then we enter the maneuver in this little enter maneuver box. So first we clean this out. Enter maneuver, paste in this little field here. Then hit apply. And then you will have it, the, uh, it'll actually do the algorithm on this cube here. And then hit add and solve again. And it'll get this really long algorithm. You can make this shorter by clicking on optimal. Then clicking this triangle here. And it'll give you the shortest one I can find, which is the one that I showed you before. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and just clean this up. Um, and we're going to save this. I've already done this. Um, we're going to go into second layer. Uh, I just made these folders here. Uh, I think my parents are back. My mom's back. Oh, great. Uh, and we're going to name it Middle Edge Flipper. Okay, right here it is. Then we're going to save that and then we're going to delete this and then we're going to create another algorithm I'm going to go ahead and clean out this entire little oops, thing um, go ahead and create this case where um, oops, these two edges here need to be flipped Okay, well, not flipped, they need to be switched, they need to be swapped. Then hit and solve. Algorithm is just going to pour in, stop it as, like, as the minute it comes on. They just try and stop it. Because this is a lot of algorithms to deal with. Hit add solutions to main window. Hit stop. And here are all the algorithms. I use the very first one. Okay. Go ahead and right click this one and hit add, uh, add generator to clipboard. Alright, then just go ahead and clear main window. Clear this out, make this clean, click paste in this little thingy here, uh, hit apply, hit add and solve, make this optimal, and save it. I saved it as middle edge swapper. Okay, and then what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and clear this out. Then what you're going to do is you're going to go into load maneuvers. You're going to load these algorithms you just made the middle edge flipper first just because you know that's the way I did it and then middle edge swapper and when this dialog box comes up hit no because then this would go away and that would be pretty annoying um, now let's go ahead and give these a label in this little box that appears next to them and label pattern name we're going to name the first one middle edge flipper and the second one um, middle edge swapper okay and now we're gonna go in I'm gonna go ahead and get in one more algorithm it's gonna be in this third layer um, this is gonna be called the top and these are all generators make sure that these are solvers uh, top edge swapper 
whoops now the reason why yeah, if you if these are all generators just click on the word generator and it turns into a solver okay top edge swapper okay we're done with that this here is going to be our little algorithm sheet you can go ahead and print this out I've actually already printed out a copy here um, that I will be showing you in um, Windows Movie Maker um, I'll even have like a link to it to where you can print it out and um, in case you want the all these algorithms and if, also in case you don't have this program um, thanks for watching I'll put the algorithm up algorithm sheet up in a minute um, and it, like I said in maybe the next video I will teach you how to memorize new algorithms because that's something that a lot of beginners have trouble with they're like I don't want to memorize I'll show you a really easy way to do it so um, uh, thanks for watching okay this here's the sheet that I was talking about that I printed um, if you notice it has a little gray line on it I just drew that in paint so that way if you download it you can actually just sort of cut it out have it a little smaller um, this is the sheets that you'll get when you this is what I'm gonna be sort of posting on the internet that you can for printing off um, yeah it's pretty much it um, this is what the sheets look like when they're printed off of Cube Explorer uh, it's gonna be kinda fuzzy I know it's kinda looking all weird and colorful and stuff and like when the you know because that's just because I scanned it off on my scanner so that's pretty much that um, I, I really hope this video helped you a lot um, I'll have a link well I'll pretty much have like a direct download link in the um, description box so um, just be looking for that when you're in the description um, hope that this video benefited you uh, thanks for watching